Hello, everybody. Today is Thursday, February 16th, and it is 4.11 p.m. The regular session for the futures markets closed 11 minutes ago. I want to bring over the time and sales. We can see the last trade for the E-mini S&P was 2345.75. And we had a pretty respectable day for the auto trader today. Before I begin, first the required disclaimer. Okay, first up is the crude oil on the Superenco 6 tick. This is using our line break logic. And we can see the line break signal to go short here at 53.51, but we didn't take the trade until we got a red bar. So the line break signals are being filtered out by the precision trend. So we got filled at our limit order at 53.52 and we took our first contract off at 15 ticks and the runner went approximately uh, 75 ticks or so anyway all in all a really great day uh, doing 1550 on two contracts we had this fantastic short at the open and then so we had three winners in in a row there and then we had a couple of losers and then we had another uh, solid long trade here that brought us I believe to our goal of 1500 and so basically we had five ticks of positive slippage because <clears throat> this was only one contract at the exit so we had extreme positive slippage uh, at the end of the trade and as I've stated many times it's it would be impossible to trade this via discretion and take these trades back to back and then also have a short like this and then have the mindset to go with the long trade uh, that would just be impossible to do uh, via discretionary trading okay this is the superenco six tick in the uh, volatility algorithm on the same chart so this had very similar trades uh, but only did 1200 for the day okay next up is the crude oil on a 500 tick chart we started off with a minor loser only drew down about hundred seventy dollars or so and then we caught this uh, reversal rally and ended up with 530 for the day on two contracts okay next we have the FDAX or the DAX on the 34 second line break and we had an equity high of almost eight hundred dollars and then we had two losers drag us down so I just want to scrunch up the chart Oh, actually, we had a couple of winners here uh, early on. So our equity high, yeah, about $800. And then a couple of losers dragged us down to 487.50. So you can kind of see uh, just from the open of the U.S. session that there was some pretty extreme volatility. We, we went down and then up and then down. And these are all pretty large swings. Back to our crude oil chart, some fantastic trades here. That's it for today's video, just a short video. It was pretty much all about the crude oil. If you'd like to find out more, please visit our website or send me an email to systems at bluewavetrading.com. Thanks for watching.